Hey what's up everyone, it's Mike from Galaxy S3 Soft Modder. In this video I'll be showing you how to get quick readings of your battery life, RAM usage, Wi-Fi signal strength, and other phone stats right in your status bar. So this app is called Powerline, it's uh, by the Urban Droid team, and it's pretty similar to an app that we covered in previous Soft Modder videos called Energy Bar. Uh, with energy bar you get a line representing your battery life um, and it'll deplete from right to left or left to right uh, whichever way you customize it and uh, power line is the same concept but you can also apply it to other system stats like your processor speed battery temperature uh, storage space and others it's available from google play uh, you can check out our full article for the download link so by default you have a battery bar set up for you already uh, you can see it in my status bar up here in blue uh, let's run through some settings first. Um, running, you can check this box to toggle it on or off. Um, hide from status bar refers to the persistent notification that shows up here. Um, it says may not be supported on all devices. Uh, specifically, it means devices on Android 4.3 or above. So if your phone is on 4.2 or below, then you can hide that persistent notification. But uh, with Android 4.3, some changes were made in the operating system and that persistent notification has to be there for the app to run. So um, hide when status bar hides. Uh, this is if you're playing a full screen game or watching a video on landscape full screen. Um, situations where the status bar hides itself, um, then you can either choose to keep your bar visible or hidden with the status bar. And start on boot uh, lets the app start as soon as you turn on your phone. So let's check out what can be done to the bar as far as customization. And you can go to type. All right, the default one is the battery, but you can also choose other system stats like your 3G or 4G signal strength, Wi-Fi strength, RAM, upload, download speeds, battery temperature, all that good stuff. And you can position it at the top or bottom or the left or right. You don't have to keep it in your status bar, but that's where I like it. Alignment is where the line will originate from. So you can have it from the start of the status bar or the end of it, or you can have it uh, be in the middle and it'll deplete from the sides inwards. You can set the transparency level. The lower the number, the more transparent it'll be. Uh, the line thickness in pixels. I like to keep it at two or three pixels. Border offset is how many pixels the bar is from the edge of the screen. So zero is no offset. It's right at the edge of the screen. If I set it to 13 pixels, it'll be 13 pixels away from the edge of the screen. Here you can set up the color of the line. You can choose certain colors for higher values and choose what number constitutes a higher value. And you can also do the same for low value colors. And the last two settings here at the bottom, uh, never hide the status bar or never hide with status bar. Uh, you can check that if you want it visible, even if the status bar is hidden. Uh, such as with full screen videos and games and uh, invert value gives you the opposite reading so instead of uh, how much battery life you have left it'll show you how much battery life you've used so you can press done when you're all finished customizing and with the free version you can have two different bars so I'm gonna set up uh, my Wi-Fi strength bar so here I have two bars uh, one's for battery life one is for Wi-Fi strength so you can have up to two different bars with the free version, but if you want to go crazy and add more than two, you can add up to nine with the unlocked version of the app. It's $1.99 to unlock the full version. So once again, the app is called Powerline. Let us know what you think of it. You can leave a comment below or at the full article at Galaxy S3 Softmodder. And don't forget to like the video and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching.